how to create a blog in Shopify. Hello everyone and welcome back. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys how you can add blogs in your Shopify store. Now, the first question you might ask is, why would I want a blog in my Shopify store? This is a store. People are meant to purchase things and that's it. Well, if you don't know already, Shopify stores are built to get the customer's attention. And if you can grab more attention in the form of blogs and have customers engage in your content for longer periods of time, you might be able to upsell them multiple different products or get them interested more in your brand as if they were to just purchase the product and then leave. So blog pages can help you in building brand identity as well as keeping your loyal customers engaged. If you take a look at any popular brand, for example, over here, we're going to go into Rare Beauty and I have a Shopify store for this makeup brand. And if I go into Rare Beauty over here, you guys will actually see they have multiple different blog pages talking about Rare Impact, their shade finders. They also have a comfort club and then they have this shop section where people can purchase products as well. So blogs are an essential part of any type of Shopify store. If I was to compare it to Fenty Beauty, let's say, and this is again another makeup brand, another competitor for makeup. If I open this up over here, you guys can see we have this discover section, which allows us to, you know, take a look at some of the articles that they have. They have Gorilla Looks, Lip Library, as seen on TikTok, gifts, accessory, and much, much more. So we're going to go ahead and go into our Shopify store and we're going to try to replicate this type of success. And we are going to do it by adding blogs about whatever type of product you have, whether you're selling makeup, you're selling clothing, you're selling digital products, anything can be converted into a relatable blog. Because I'm selling makeup, I can create blogs about skincare, about how to apply the makeup or how to create the best looks. And then I can hyperlink and talk about my own products in those blogs. To get started with this, we're gonna go into our Shopify dashboard. And once we go into our Shopify dashboard, we're gonna click on online store. Once we click on online store over here, you guys will see your online store is password protected and you will have you know information. But when you click on online store, on the left, it says blog posts. So you're gonna click on blog posts over here and you're going to click on create blog post and you can get started with adding your first blog post. Now I have used ChatGPT to create a blog on no makeup makeup and I'm just going to copy this and add this into my Shopify store and then we're going to add the title the no makeup makeup look effortless beauty naturally the no makeup makeup look using lilies. And just like that, I can add information about my own products. I can link my own products. So apply a liquid or cream highlighter to the high points of your face. Instead of saying apply a liquid or cream highlighter, I can add apply our eyeshadow palette powder highlighter for a natural glow like this. And then I can just click on save. I can even hyperlink that. The way to hyperlink is simply to select the text. Then you're going to click on insert link. And then in a new window, I will link it to my own product. I would just copy and paste the link and then just click on insert over here like so. Then once you've done that, you will see on the right you have visibility. So I'm going to make this visible. And then you can click on add image to add an image. Then you have your organization author. So whoever the author you want to add is, you can add that. This has to be a user on your Shopify store. And you can add the blogs as either news or you can create a new blog. And this is going to be makeup frenzy, let's say. And then below that, we have our default theme template. Then you can add your excerpt, which is going to be a summary of your blog post that is going to appear on the home page of your blog. So we're going to ask ChatGPT to write the excerpt. I did not spell this correctly, but I hope you guys do not mind that. And it's editing. No, I'm just going to summary of this. Yeah, it has generated my excerpt for me. And then we're going to click on add. We're going to paste this in. Then once we've done that, we're going to just click on save. 
Now, once we've clicked on save, this is going to add our new blog post into our Shopify blog. But you might say, hey, if I open up my Shopify store, how would people actually access my blog? Well, for that, we're going to actually add a blog section and you can click on manage blogs over here and build multiple different blog posts. But we have two different types of blogs. We have makeup frenzy and the news and you can add different blogs for different areas of your initiative. So if you have things that are more so related to some other project that your brand is tied to, you can build a separate blog for that. But what we're going to do is we're going to click on online store on the left. Then we're going to click on navigation under our online store. Once you click on navigation, you have your main menu. So you're going to click on your main menu. Once you click on your main menu here, we are going to simply scroll down, click on add menu item. Then you're just going to click on the link option, scroll down, and you're going to see blog posts or blogs. Simply select Makeup Frenzy or whatever the blog name is to add that to your navigation menu and then click on save. Once we've done that, if I open up my online store over here, you guys can see Makeup Frenzy is added as a simple option on top and you guys can see our first blog post that we just wrote. And if I open this up, we can see the complete blog information. And just like that, you have your own blog. Now, if I have a donation that I'm doing or if my brand is currently working with any type of funding or any type of, you know, secondary or helping out, you know, some type of organization, whatever it is, it doesn't matter what it is. I can add that as a separate blog to showcase or to record all the initiatives that we're doing in that other blog but it's not going to be under makeup frenzy instead we can add another one for that and you can rename this in your navigation into just blogs if you don't want to you know name your blog a certain thing i personally just prefer to name my blogs and that is how you can create your own blogs using shopify i hope you guys found this video helpful and you now understand and want to utilize the power of blogs within your own shopify store make sure to like this video and subscribe to the youtube channel and comment down below the best tips and tricks that i have taught you within this video and make sure to also share this video with your friends and family and to other creators as well so you can help them out as well and to anyone that might need to know this basic detailed platform and how you navigate through these different social websites so I hope this was helpful enough for you and make sure that you do leave a comment down below if I missed out on anything and if there is anything you would like to add and I will catch you guys in the next video.